They don't have to agree with me. But they're still fucking wrong. Did this not open properly? Oh, no, thanks. Oh, good girl. Thanks, he's done a runner. Good girl, bitch. Good girl. There you go. That's a good girl. This is very awkward. <laughs> Our are so fat. Too much fat protein. Simple as that. Simple as that. Next dog, please adopt, don't shop. Next child, please adopt, don't pop. Motherfuckers, go vegan. Okay, so we've got a question here. People say, what's your qualifications? One, two, three, four, five, six. Whew. Sort of get it. Uh, seriously, though, we have a question. What the hell's going on here? Uh, so the question's about bloating. Um, bloating. So... I'm not, I don't know. I'm, I'm maybe I'm qualified. Just maybe I'm qualified to answer this question about bloating. What do you guys think? Is Duran Rider qualified to answer a question about bloating? I think I am. Uh, so this person went to see a naturopath. Hang on, no, so a psychopath, naturopath, homeopath, psychopath, osteopath, same thing. Um, but a chiropractor is a chiropractor. I've got, I know some good chiropractors out there. I know some good chiropractors out there. So there's, there's a cat outside playing around. Like, anyway, just pussy everywhere here. But, um, so this chiropractor says to a person, I've picked up a parasite in barley and it's causing bloating, stomach issues. Now, I'm in a barley a lot. I go to Thailand a lot. I drink a lot of the local water, a lot of local fruits, a lot of those vegan food. I've been going overseas to Asia for the last, since 2001. You know, so a long time, a long time. And uh, so the chiropractor says where fruit and refined sugar uh, feeds the parasites, causes bloating. God's is bloating. The chiropractor said that. It doesn't matter who the fuck says that. That's absolute fucking bullshit. All right? It's bullshit. And, uh, you know, like people say, what's your qualifications doing right? <laughs> I can talk about bloating, can't I? So we have this fucking nonsense out there, sincerely, sincerely wrong. And so this person said to me, they um, end up buying some, or they said to my friend, uh, they, they end up purchasing some. What do you go? They go to these chiropractors, and they always sell you some fucking or osteopaths or naturopaths or any sort of you know such and such person. They sell these little lightweight, expensive, shippable products. Maybe they come from China or Peru or some cheap economy where they can mark it up thousand percent in the name of health, in the name of health, in the name of community. Mark it up a thousand percent in the name of doing something good. Mark it right up. <laughs> make it make it health really expensive. And uh, so I think this is bullshit. But fruit and refined sugar feeds parasites, so you have to cut out the fruit. Apparently, take some expensive herbs. And then maybe one day you might get lean and have no bloating like Duran Rider, the uh, sugar addict here in Adelaide, South Australia. So I would say that, I mean, what is even the question? What is even the question? There is no question that parasites are fed on sugar or fruit, so you have to cut it out. It's like, well, that's like saying drug dealers run on money, so we have to take all the money out of the system until the drug dealers die from starvation. And in that way, no one can have money until that happens. And that's absolute, it's stupid. You can't eat fruit or sugar because it will starve the, the cancer seals and all the, the parasites. All the, what? The human immune system runs on sugar, glucose and fructose, all right? Your muscles run on glucose and fructose. Your sperm cells run on fructose. You know, your, your ovaries, your brain cells, glucose and fructose. You need these things. So if the parasites do run on these things, it doesn't matter because you need to have these things in your diet every day, every meal. Otherwise, you're going to be subpar human. And you're never going to achieve your fitness goals or whatever your goals you're looking for. And for me, I like having high energy. I like being lean. And I like being a troll. And I like having good times. I like being fun. Um, and I have a strong belief out there that my advice fucking works. And these fucking f people who don't look the part or whatever, their advice is wrong. So I recommend people out there, take advice from people getting the results you desire. If you want to be 40 years of age and be as lean as fit as me, Somebody say, you look like a crack addict. I never want to see my abs. I just want to have a big fat gut all my life. And hey, that's fine. I never want to see my delts. I never want to see the back of my triceps. Oh, that's too skinny, dude. Your face is too lean, mate. You're too shredded. Oh, I put some fat on. If that's for you, then do that. But if your goal is to run a fucking 230 marathon or fucking kick out a sub 17 5K or whatever right across Australia or fucking create a YouTube fucking empire, these cats are fucking play fun on the side. And then I got advice for you. So in terms of bloating, the best food you can eat is fruit. Fruit's like number one digestive food. I've got two ebooks out. Carve the fuck up. Do not see anybody by. We'll link them down below. Get people should get those books. Latest editions on doing.com. 
hate to be the sales guy, but those books are so affordable, they're so packed with information, and I've got fucking 5,000 videos up on YouTube about my dietary lifestyle recommendations. So, fruit's number one food out there. The raw to four lifestyle that I created, the cycling, the early nights, the B12, stuff like that, the good vibes, then that fucking works, man. Look at me, look at the people who've been following that or selling that, or promoting that, or whatever. Can you see a fat, bloated person in there long term? You can't. You can't. So, this advice works. This cat's a play on my tower. It's pretty rad. I've got straight cats in my backyard right now. And they're having a good time. But uh, that's another issue to talk about. But anyway, so that's the, the whole uh, naturopath, fucking chiropractor, homeopath, psychopath person who says, don't eat fruit. It's bad for bloating. Then just show them this video. Show them doing order. 17 years in April. Smashing the fruit in. Smashing in the fruit. Box of bananas is right out, but I get some more tomorrow. Today we had watermelon, sugar, and mint in the smoothies, blended right up. High carb, low fat, vegan for the win. Anyone else says anything otherwise, they don't have to agree with me. But they're still fucking wrong. <laughs>